And yo, what's good? It's your boy KG, the one that loves God, fears God, and I love the game of basketball. Now, for those that don't know, I also like Marvel. I'm a Marvel head. Yes, I am. I'm also a big time movie head. I love movies. And one quick thing I want to say before I get into this Doctor Strange 2 review is that I always wanted to get in a film. First was basketball, then was music, then was film. I love filming. And I also wanted to try to, like, you know, go out for some Marvel movies, uh, you know, start doing my own films, start shooting faith based films. I'm just, I don't know, man. I, I love I love entertainment. That's just me. But enough of all that. Enough of all that. You came here for the review. I'm going to give you guys a quick review and let you guys know what I thought about Doctor Strange 2. Now, on a 1 to 10 scale, I'm going to go ahead and give this movie a 6. I'm just saying, man. Like, yo. I got to give it a 6 out of a 1 to 10. I give him a 6 because they tried. They tried. And it's been rumors for some years now that they wanted Doctor Strange 2 to be rated R. They wanted to be rated R. They wanted to have a very, very dark tone. I was all for that because I feel like Doctor Strange needs to be rated R, if that makes sense. You know, the kind of character he is, the kind of, you know... Hero, superhero, whatever you want to call him. I, I feel like he needed to go rated R, but it just didn't work out. But like I said, I will give this movie a six on a one to ten scale. They tried. I feel like they could have did a lot better. I also feel like it was kind of rushed. Also felt like some things were kind of forced. Now I'm not going to give you guys any spoilers, but I, I do like this girl that you guys see on the screen, American Chavez. I like her. She's pretty she's pretty dope. She's pretty good. Pretty good. You know what I'm saying? And and, and the kind of eyes that I have going into movies, acting is very, very important to me. If you start, if you can't act, I can't rock with you. I just can't. I'm not gonna respect your craft because I'm gonna feel like, yo, you gotta make me like your character. You have to make me fall in love with the character. You know what I'm saying? I'm I'm just saying, baby. But she did a good job. She did a good job. Also, Dr. Strange, you know, he, he's always pulling it off. That man is a brilliant actor. I love what he did. I love what Wong did. Everybody did a good job. But I just felt like the plot, I just felt like, you know, where they was going with the story. Uh, I was just like, oh, man. I waited for this. You know what I'm saying? I waited all this time for this. No, Marvel. No, no. So I don't know. I'm I'm like I'm kind of on a fence now because uh, I don't know, man. Even the Eternals, it just wasn't good. And it had so much potential. So much potential that I was like, "Oh, Eternals is going to be the best Marvel movie ever." And then it ended up being a 4. On a 1 to 10 scale. In my eyes. And to a lot of people. Eternals just. Oh man. And then I'm looking at. You know. Doctor Strange. I was like. Okay. Surely. Doctor Strange 2 will pull through. Yeah. Yeah. Doctor Strange 2 won't be. Won't be off the hook. But it just. It was just a letdown. It, it was a letdown. It honestly should have went to. Disney Plus. And the movie theater. That's just my honest to God opinion. I don't know. I am disappointed. Um, I don't think that I'm going to be. I'm not going to prepare myself for a letdown again. That's that's how I'm feeling right now. You know, so whatever Marvel movies coming out next, like Black Panther two and all that, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna really get too excited for it. I'm gonna just when it comes, it comes, and hopefully it'll be a ten out of ten. I uh, I don't know. I don't know if Marvel's getting lazy. Uh, I don't know the visuals. The visuals on Doctor Strange 2 was, was pretty good. But like I said, the storyline, the plot, I, I just feel like everything was rushed. And we're, we're, we're going to make Doctor Strange 2. Like, we're gonna, you know, it, it was rushed. You guys should have waited just a little bit and uh, made the storyline just a little bit richer. But I don't know. I don't know if I'm ready for Doctor Strange 3. Y'all be blessed. Always remember, keep God first and everything else won't fall into place. Peace.